named Tiki Lounge, beautiful fish, Zeus and Hercules. Oh no, oh no. Go bananas. Dither fish. They're actually a breeding pair. Of oh jeez. Remember Robin Big? No. Aloha, my ohana. It is your boy back with another aquatic adventure. Now, if you're new to the channel, let me be the first to give you a nice big warm aloha and welcome. Matter of fact, let me give you guys a big melikalikimaka because today is Christmas. Hope you guys are having a great time with your friends and family and just having a very festive day. Open up those presents and throw down a little something for your boy, all right? Now on my channel, we talk about everything aquatics, whether it be freshwater or saltwater, goldfish and koi ponds, local fish store tours, fish rescues, DIY projects and product reviews in the hobby. Behind me here, 125 gallon aquarium in my fish room named Tiki Lounge. I'm converting my garage into my fish room. Now I'm gonna give you guys an update on all the fish in here. I'm gonna flip the camera around and we're gonna talk a little bit about dither fish. D-I-T-H-E-R. Here they are, my Ohana, they're all doing great. Now we do have five beautiful clown loaches. One of them is a really nice size. The clown loaches are all doing great. Uh, we do have some beautiful severums. Look at this beautiful red severum, red spotted severum I just picked up over at Aquarium and Reptile Depot. I needed to add this severum to my collection. Uh, my big red severum or spotted red severum, whatever you wanna call it, he passed away, that was red bone. This is is red bone 2.0 so i had to pick up that beautiful red severum uh we have a gold severum right there look at the red shoulder severum there we have a green severum which looks black but he's considered a green there he goes he moved right into the light we have a turquoise severum right there it's robert van winkle aka vanilla ice and that gold severum by the way that's madonna i've had them for quite a bit they're actually a breeding pair we have a bunch of different uh, Geo Vegas. Well, just two types. We have uh, Balzani, and then we also have Redhead Tapaho Geo Vegas. Um, and then, of course, we have these beautiful electric blue Acaras. Now, a lot of you guys were asking about the electric blue Acaras. They're doing great. That one there, super healthy when I got him. Uh, this one here wasn't so healthy. This was the one that was like on its deathbed. But look at him swimming around, doing great. Just great news. I'm so glad that this guy made it. I was getting so scared. I picked him up, he was literally on his side. I treated him with Minfin. My boy bounced back, and like I call Minfin, the wonder drug for aquarium fish. And look at him, look at him. Hey, he's just like a little puppy dog. I love this guy. I also have four plecos in this aquarium. I do have a beautiful gold nugget pleco, which he usually hides on behind this piece of driftwood. Uh, he's doing great. I also have two rubber mouth or rubber lip plecos. And then I have a beautiful lemon blue eyed pleco, which loves to hang out on this piece of driftwood here. And obviously, so do the clown loaches. So once in a blue moon, especially when I feed this aquarium, they all come out, they all play, they all eat. Matter of fact, why don't I throw some food in here so we can watch all of these guys feast. Now, if you guys are curious what we're gonna feed them, it's Vibra Bites. They're small, they're little, they look like like little blood worms if you wanted to like describe them and these fish go nutsos for it so i'm gonna go ahead and grab a big pinch and stick it in the aquarium for these guys pop the lid and you'll see what the food looks like when i put it in there there you go you can actually see the food falling down these guys go bananas even the clown loaches for these little vibrabites and we might be able to get a glimpse of the plecos they'll come out and start to eat oh i forgot to tell you guys i also have these beautiful rainbow cichlids there's one right there you can see them beautiful there's three of those guys if you look really good there's the gold nugget pleco that's right by the intake valve so that's super cool we got to see him oh my gosh these fish just get out of the way guys look at him there he is we got one of the rainbow cichlids there they're actually such a beautiful fish they definitely hold their own in this aquarium that's for sure Oh, this is a treat, my Ohana. This is the lemon blue-eyed pleco. Look how beautiful. Oh, look at, oh, another treat, guys. The rubber lip pleco. Oh, no, there he goes, there he goes. Oh, 
They love going underneath there. All right, so let's talk about the term dither fish. All of these fish in this aquarium are considered dither fish for Oscars. So it just makes sense to transfer the Oscars in this aquarium. So clown loaches make a beautiful and a great dither fish for Oscars. Severums definitely make a nice dither fish, as well as electric blue acaras. The only fish I'm concerned in in this aquarium would probably be maybe the plecos and or the rainbow cichlids. Those are the only two species of fish that I had a little bit of worried about, but there's so many hides in this aquarium with these two big pieces of driftwood, these plants, and I think the Oscars will be okay with all of these fish in here. Uh, basically, the term dither fish is a group of aquarium fish that help reduce aggression in an aquarium and also help promote normal behavior amongst the fish in the aquarium. So that's what dither fish do. All of these fish here will be perfect for Rob and Big. So we're gonna go ahead and transfer them into this aquarium. You guys do not wanna miss this. I'm actually kind of curious and nervous all in one. I'm actually happy for Big because he's gonna have a nice six foot aquarium to swim around in um, along with Rob. So uh, let's go ahead and grab those fish and put them in this new home of theirs. Let me tell you something, Rob and Big are gonna be like George and Wheezy. You know the Jeffersons. Well, we're moving on up, we're moving on up to the east side. We're on up. Okay, so behind me are my two Ocellaris peacock bass, Zeus and Hercules. And then we have Big, my long fin tiger Oscar, and then I have Lamont, my albino tiger Oscar. Now I'm thinking about changing Lamont's name to Rob, so we got Rob and Big. Remember the Rob and Big show? People let me tell you about my best friend. He's a warm-hearted person. Now this is something I wanted to do for Rob and Big was move them into the 125. This was something that was always in the making ever since I got that aquarium and those fish. Now those fish in there will be just the perfect companion. In this aquarium here, we're still gonna have Zeus and Hercules, the two Ocellaris peacock bass, so they're gonna have a lot more space. Let me flip this camera around and show you guys what Big does. Now, Big has just been super depressed ever since I put Hercules in this aquarium. He's been not really stressed out, but if you guys know the personality of an Oscar, they kind of sulk. They're pretty funny. Anyways, I'm gonna show you what he does. Oh, you got Big Mighty Zeus right there opening his mouth. You got Hercules right there. He's a little bit smaller than Zeus. You got Rob the albino tiger Oscar. And then you got Big, who just hangs out here at the bottom. I do feel bad for my guy. He's been with me for a while. I actually rescued this guy from a 20 gallon tank. Somebody was moving and this poor guy couldn't even turn around in the aquarium. Gave him a lot more space, but to be honest, like I said, ever since I added this guy, Hercules, He's been a little depressed. So I think I'm gonna make his day today. We're gonna actually move him into the 125. It's gonna be a little task, but I want you guys to see his reaction when we move him into that aquarium. So you can see Big is behind this big piece of driftwood. We're gonna use this humongous net and grab that bad boy and go stick him in his new home. Now I gotta watch Zeus and Hercules. They're super aggressive. Get out of the way, get out of the way. We're gonna go ahead and carefully net big. Don't worry, big, it's for your own good. All right, here we go. Oh no, oh no, oh no, don't make a mess, bud. Don't make a mess. Oh, here goes big, here goes big in his new home. No! You're okay. Oh, welcome home. Welcome home, big. Look at you, <laughs> look at you. <laughs> Biggie, biggie, baby, baby, you have so much more room now. All right, let's go get Rob and put Rob in here too, his little sidekick. Rob's gonna get stressed out. I swear Rob has been by big size ever since I put them two together. So let's go ahead and go get Rob. Let's net Rob, come on, Rob. Come on, buddy. All right, we got Rob in the net. We're gonna go ahead and flip him around and then uh, go take him. Oh, jeez. It's okay. It's okay, Rob. It's okay, Rob. It's okay. Here you go. There you go. There's Robbie Rob in his new aquarium. Of course, he's going to go run and look for Big. And look who found Big. Rob did. Look at him. This kind of reminds me of that song. Reunited and it feels so good. Reunited. 
united cause we understood there's one perfect thing ding 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 sorry i don't know the words guys sorry anyways we're gonna let these guys settle in and we'll get back to them pronto Big's on the on the go. Uh oh, this is the first time I've seen him swim on this side of the aquarium. Look at him! Look at him! Look at him! Those are wiggles of being happy and free. Look at him just swimming around, going back to his little driftwood spot. Of course, he's got to get used to it. Everybody's staying out of his way, but they don't seem too frightened or stressed, which is nice. And that's where the dither fish kick in. Look at you got my Geo Vegas up there, Balzani. Over here, we got some Red Hood Tapahoes. They're hanging out over here. We got Madonna, the Gold Severum, Clown Loach. Everybody's just kind of living their life. Look at this beautiful Tiger Stripe Severum. This guy's nice. Look at him. Ooh, he's coming. Ooh, he, I've had that guy since he was little. Super tiny. Same thing with this Green Severum. Super tiny. And then we have our beautiful Electric Blue Acaras. We have. Vanilla Ice, the Turquoise Severum. We got some more Balzani, uh, Redhead Tapaho, Geo Vegas, this beautiful Red Bone. We're gonna call him Red Bone 2.0. We'll just call him Red Bone. Beautiful Red Spotted Severum. And then we have the beautiful Red Shoulder Severum. Look at him. Ooh, that Red Shoulder Severum is beautiful. Excellent dither fish for these beautiful Oscars. I'm happy for the Oscars because they have a lot more room, a lot more space to swim around in. Look it. Ah. Oh. Hey, Rob. How's it going, buddy? I know you're a little stressed out still, but trust me, it's for your own good. We have the beautiful rainbow cichlids. They're so pretty. Look at them. All three of them usually hang out together. Um, I'm not sure if I have male, female, or what their deal is. They're normally like yellow, but because of this aquarium is super dark, probably because of the background, they're super dark which I'm okay with. You guys gotta let me know what you think about the six foot, 125 gallon aquarium for Rob and Big. We actually renamed Rob. He was Lamon, but we're calling him Rob. It just makes sense, Rob and Big. I'm super glad I was able to move Rob and Big into this aquarium. Now I know Zeus and Hercules are gonna be fine in that aquarium. And to be honest with you, Big was super depressed in that aquarium, sulking at the bottom. That's just the personality of an Oscar. Ever since I added Hercules, he was not having it. So I'm happy for him. He's got a lot more space in here. I just have my fingers crossed that none of these dither fish that I'm super attached to end up missing tomorrow or injured or floating, you know what I mean? So fingers crossed, I will keep you guys posted and updated on all these fish in this aquarium. Uh, also, Ohana, Melikiliki Maka, which is Merry Christmas in Hawaiian. I hope you guys had a beautiful and wonderful Christmas with your friends, with family, or even by yourself at home. Like we're here, we're at the house. We're not going anywhere. And if you guys are traveling, safe travels all the way back to your destination. Other than that, I will see you guys on the next video, Ohana. Take care, much love. And aloha!